In this video, I'm going to show you the new matter filing process. Prior to starting this process, we advise that you have all of your attachments readily available for filing. First, let's click on the new matter filing button. Then, we'll want to select the industry affected, matter type, and matter subtype. Then, we'll select the company or organizations from your company and organization list. You'll notice that the title and filing description will auto-populate based on your selections. You may make adjustments to these fields as needed. After the information is correctly entered, press the Next button to navigate to the Document Upload page. Here on the Document Upload page, you may click the Browse button or drag and drop files into the gray area. After the document is uploaded, adjust the document title if needed. Select the document type and identify the security level of each individual document. In this example, we're going to file a confidential document. Filing a confidential document requires that you also file a cover letter as well as a redacted version of each confidential document. Once all the documents that are related to this filing have been uploaded, given a proper document name, a document type, and a security level, you may click the button to submit your filing or proceed to the next step. Because I'm including a confidential document in this filing, I'm also required to fill out the Request for Nondisclosure form to justify the need for confidential filing. Check the appropriate boxes and fill out the justification field. If you are filing a new matter or if you haven't already indicated service list and party list preferences, you will be prompted to do so on the service list information page. Here, you may indicate your electronic consent, email preference, and party list information. On the Matter Filing Confirmation page, you may review your submitted filing. If you filed a new matter, the newly created matter number will be listed here. If you filed to an existing matter, that will simply list the matter number that you filed to. At this point, you may choose to print your submitted forms or go back to the home page to make another filing. You will receive a notification from dmm at dps.ny.gov informing you that the filing has been received and is pending further processing. Filings submitted through this method are typically processed within 30 minutes during normal business hours. If no issues are found with the filing, you will receive a notification from the Commission Secretary that the filing has been posted and is available for viewing. Department staff will contact you via phone or email should they have any questions regarding your filing. Inquiries about filings can be submitted to secretary at dps.ny.gov. Thank you for watching this video.